During the new episode of Red Table Talk, Jada Pinkett Smith briefly addressed the Oscar slap. Jada said, now about Oscar night, my deepest hope is that these two intelligent, capable men have an opportunity to heal, talk this out and reconcile. The state of the world today, we need them both. And we all actually need one another more than ever. Um, until then, Will and I are continuing to do what we have done for the last 28 years, and that's keep figuring out this thing called life together. What are your thoughts on Jada's comments? Who wants to go first on this one? Um, it was a beautiful statement. I love the part about, I mean, especially when we start talking about the Black community, Black male leadership, Black excellence, and Black success. She was 100% right. We do need both of them. They're both extraordinary men. Um, but hell, for you started this shit, this mess. <laughs> okay, excuse my French. You started this mess. So I don't know. Maybe it would have felt better coming from Gammy, the mama, and not you, Jada. Um, but I, I can get down with the statement. Uh, what you think? Uh, I can't. I, 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 I just can't. I just can't. I just can't. I just can't. I would prefer her not talk about it um, or talk about it in a real way. Like talk about how you really are feeling about it. Talk about how you're really feeling about your husband's actions and your own actions. That's the only way. I don't want anything else from the Smiths right now that's not real, authentic, and transparent. Other than that, I feel like you're trying to pull wool over my eyes like you've done for the last 25 plus years. Y'all gonna say I hate Jada. I don't hate Jada. I hate the situation. Um... I'm going to need Jada from Set It Off. This new age crystals and I'm a I'm an expert at life and I'm a life coach to everybody else and I have all this wisdom. It's not feeling authentic. It's feeling very fake. It's feeling very fake. It feels like you're gaslighting us. You sat there and laughed when Will did this. And it was, and it, it, we've been waiting, what, two months, three months for something? And this is what you come with? This bullshit ass statement? That's what it feels like to me. I'm sorry. I'm going by my gut, not my brain. It feels very fake. And very curated, like your show, and this stance you take on everything. Oh, healing and this and that and the third. We're going to Egypt. We're going to bathe in these waters. Girl, bye. <laughs> you, should have, you, I wish you'd have been more accountable and said, you know what? I wish I'd have done more that night. And, right. and, or, or, or get off my husband. I had a part in this. Or, you know what? Just talk about how hurt you are about the alopecia. Just something. This feels so effing fake, and I hate it. I hate it. And no, she did not make Will slap Chris. He did it on his own. So I'm not going to blame her for it. But you laughed when he did it. And now it's all about healing and Zen. You know what? If my man was out of pocket that night, I would have been, I would have been laughing. I'm like, yo, chill. What are you doing? You're about to get the Oscar. It was crazy. I, 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 the statement is just. And, 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 and kept this statement. We keep us waiting this long for that bullshit. And, and, and let's just add one thing to this. She didn't physically make him do it. She did not physically make him do it. But just like people have Stockholm syndrome and people can be brainwashed, she definitely catered to the emotional and mental mind state that that man was in that led him to do that. So she, I'm not blaming a black woman. She didn't physically make him do it, but she had a hand in the state of mind that he was in that led him to do that. Right, because she knows all the things that we don't know about his trauma. She knows all the things about him feeling guilty about not protecting his mom and all these things. And I'm going to not just let Jada be out there on her own, okay, before you'll come for me. Will, you need to say something. You should say something, too. Don't let your wife be out there the only one taking the heat. You're the one that committed the assault. You should actually say something as well, because we've been rocking with you for a long time. I think I, I'm with you, Al. I don't want to hear nothing from neither one of them for a long time, unless it's some real talk from Philly, Baltimore talk. Go back to your roots before this fake Hollywood, English accent, British accent. Perhaps we'll have healing. No, go back and give us some real dialogue, because this feels hella fake. And I'm over it. All right, we're gonna take a quick commercial break. <laughs> I'm gonna get cussed out. I already know. We'll be right back. <laughs> Two minutes. We'll be right back. <laughs> 